Hello and welcome back to another installment of Pokey Fodder. And today we have the Ghost Ghost Gym, Ghost Gym Part Two, whatever you want to call it. We have a gym. If we look at the event details, get Ex Gorgeist and you see Pumpkaboo as a reward for achieving victory. Ghost type, get the one MP buff and the plus 20 attack buff. And it runs for a week. Remember last time it was for four days. This time they give you seven days to do 30 games. It's a little over four wins per day to reach the final reward. If my math is correct on that. Because five would be 35 wins. And then you have until Halloween to claim the rewards. And what I've noticed is when the reward redemption is over, usually something happens following that. So I'm interested to see what happens on Halloween starting at 8 o'clock in the morning. I don't know what day of the week that is. I could go look. But my guess is something will be happening on Halloween day. If we look at the rewards, now here is the sad state of affairs. And <clears throat> you'll notice when I do my first game, <laughs> I, I, I haven't even picked up the booster ticket for the first win yet. And I've played three games, lost them all badly. Two booster tickets, 20 gems, some ingots, rare metal, carmonite, pump kaboo at 10 wins, a cube, more carmonite, some metals, even more carmonite, gorgeist at 20, all the way up to 30. So there you go. They, they ended up, I know I said yes, in yesterday's video, I didn't think there were going to be Pokemon in this banner, but I was wrong. We got Korgeist and Pumpkaboo. Look pretty interesting. I haven't really inspected them. If you follow me on Twitter or on Discord, I did. And this is just a moment of me just being like full disclosure for you guys. If you don't follow on Twitter or Discord and you just watch the videos and play the game, that's totally fine. But the girlfriend is out of town today. I took, I, I did work this morning, but it was a light day. And so I took this opportunity of kind of a me day and I spent it with you guys in a way. I took my main account and played on live stream until I reached 30 wins. And I got hammered a lot. And I won some games. But it was mostly a grind. I'm not going to lie. So the point of that is two things. I'm kind of burned out <laughs> on the game at, at this exact moment. Not forever, but in making this video... Like I'm not as excited as I should be going into doing more gym games, but, but I'm going to do the video and I'm going to put content out for you guys. But my main account does have both the new Pokemon and I will do a feature on them in the coming days. I've already heard some ideas of different deck ideas being thrown around. I haven't paid a whole lot of attention to them, but there are some pretty creative deck ideas going on out there that I will look into and explore more when the time is right. So here we go. I'm going to get guaranteed. This is my ironclad pokey fodder guarantee. I'm going to get my first win in the gym right now full of energy, 
playing Bugbot. <laughs> oh man. And there it is, Bugbot. Look at my rank, 1415. Like I'm gonna get 20, 30 points for beating Bugbot here. Of course, this is gonna be really embarrassing if I don't beat Bugbot. This is the deck I'm running. <laughs> the only other ghost type that I have is Shuppet. And may maybe I should run Shuppet. I Man, who knows? I just went with the best that I could go with. I might need to put Vibrava back in. And I am, like I said, going to get that ever important first victory. God, it feels good. <laughs> 34 points for that. And a booster ticket. Now, typically, I wouldn't open the booster ticket, but, 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 but. I am on my free-to-play account <clears throat> in the hopes that it gets me something I can use in the gym. Well, we are back after my game crashed. And if you will notice, we picked up a Noibat with her booster. Hmm. Okay. I will do, I will fuse that away at another time. But let's play a real. My deck isn't very good. In, in fact, I'm, I'm just going to call a spade a spade. It's terrible. It really is. Like, I, like I've said before, with this account, I'm not keeping a bunch of inventory. I'm not using gems to expand my, my Pokédex except for when I absolutely have to. And I think that this is kind of the best that I can do. Fibraba could probably replace Fletchinger. I put in Fletchinger simply for the burn and because it's gold and then Talonflame at 110 with gold, I thought would be helpful. Plates that I'm running and and here I go. I'm, up. I'm torn. Do I, do I dive into shop it here? <laughs> I mean, I think I kind of have to, right? You kind of have to. But if I lose, if I... Okay, I'm going to do it. Wait, what is he? Let's see, he's 30 now. I'm not going to do it. I'm actually just going to... Could have X attacked. That would have been another option. These matchups that I shouldn't have to think about, that I absolutely have to think about, give me trouble. So shove it at 30. Eee. This is Mega Gengar. We could be... It is. I am... <coughs> going to try to just knock him out and that's fine with me yes i'm getting knocked out but getting mega gengar off the board even though it's not going to really last for very long okay going to see if we can't get him off the board nope <clears throat> Not, it's not looking good. It's not looking good at all. Going to rush up here. I don't remember. Did he have a hurdle? He does not have a hurdle jump. So we're good there. I'd be surprised if he had long throw, and he does not. So... That's a good opportunity to go ahead and take the entry point here. Swap spot, double chance, X attack, scoop, hurdle jump, 
and hurdle jump. My opponent's name is G Funk. <laughs> Go ahead and bring Deoxys out. And after this, I don't know. I, I guess my next best move is to put Bennett on my entry point. And X attack, shuff it. God, it sounds so bad. I have to use Mew to X, I have to use an X attack on Mew to go after shuff it. Except shuff it's coming after me. <laughs> Oh boy. I think I think that's best. That's not good. No slip. Thank you, thank you, thank you. No, definitely needed that one. <sighs> I don't know what to do here. Um, oh, I know what I can do. If I don't get knocked out here... Okay, never mind then. I was gonna say I could do a, a scoop, a scoop and surround, but I don't need to. As you can see, I've put in some work on my on my deck. I've got my Solgaleo to level nine. I got my Mew up to level five. Good things. Roost. No, not miss. Anything but miss. So I'm, I'm slowly getting my deck built up. At this point, though, I don't know where to put... Man, I, I think I just go after this again. I don't know where to put my resources at the moment, though. I'm kind of kind of at a standstill because I hope he takes Vibe Robin to my corner. Because I don't have a room the room to stockpile my my rare metal. Let's see what's gonna happen here. Who's gonna get bombasted? E. That's no good. <laughs> we need him to redo that, please. I can, I can kind of live with that. The good news about that is I can definitely, what am I doing? Cancel, go away. Man, I almost made such a bad play. Because I can't, and I'm not stockpiling my resources, I don't really know what to level up next because I don't know how long I'm going to be using some of this stuff. And it's created quite the quandary. Because I have Mew. Mew is done. I get for now I'm putting it in Deoxys attack. But honestly, I don't know if that's the best place for it. Um, I, I, I'm in a bad position here. And I'm not going against like the greatest deck build ever. Problem is, oh wow, thank you. <laughs> yes, we are definitely going to evolve you. The problem is, is my deck is not the best build either. I kind of just have to go with it. And I seriously doubt, even with seven days, I seriously doubt that I'm going to make it 
to 30 wins because I don't know how I'm going to get four per day. I probably could have gotten four. I mean, this could be two if if I can stave off Articuno right here, <clears throat> which is going to be tough. And I, I didn't even, like, I just flat out lost. <laughs> so what do we do now? Yeah, I don't know. I got one. I don't know if you can beat Bugbot four times a day. All right, this is, we cannot, we absolutely positively cannot afford to roll miss here. He is burned. It's a big roll for us if, if we have any hopes of winning this match. That was about the worst possible outcome that we could have had. That's absolutely terrible. <clears throat> Wait, why? Oh, Roost was the... Oh, what the heck? Oh my goodness. Roost was the smallest attack, so it's the one that... All right, here we go. I cannot believe he didn't freeze me. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Now is Gen Gengar, it's 120. So if I roll my 120 into his 120, I win. If he rolls toxic, dodge or miss, I win. If I roll 100, That was literally the only way that he could win that. Is if I roll one, it, he had to roll his white. Which, I mean, 41 is not, it's not a small slice there, but that's like 60% chance to not roll your white. And I have, oh, I don't have my double chance anymore. Going to X attack, but in my heart of hearts, I'm actually hoping that I roll a blue here so I can shuttle flip cheese onto his goal. Didn't happen. So now he's doing 21. One water shuriken. Wait, what? Why would you X? Be that. I don't have any purple. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> oh man. This guy cannot buy a break. Man, oh man. And the game's moving really slow. I'm actually playing on an iPad. I've heard other people say that when they record off of their iPad, it, it moves slow, like the frame rate is a little laggy or something. Hmm. Man. I was down there twice. Couldn't make it happen. I believe my best bet is to just go ahead. Can we get knocked out and leave the burn? <laughs> so for those of you who have several of the newer Pokemon, this is probably pretty painful for you to watch. But for the newer players and, and the players, basically the newer players, because even free to play, you've, you've probably got a little bit more of a, a gym ready deck than this one. But for the newer players, this is, this is probably a, a pretty normal experience. He's got chain levels on his Articuno already. 
<clears throat> I do apologize. My my allergies are, I don't know, draining. So here we go for the third time. We have the opportunity to win just as long as we don't lose this roll. That works. That is good enough for me. So we're halfway to our four per day. I, I just don't see, I just don't see getting four per day. I'm not gonna rule it out, but something on my screen there. That's why you see me. And we'll go one more, right? We'll do, we'll do an even three. We'll see if we can't even up our record at three wins and three losses for the gym. Oh my. So this is not going to be pretty. <laughs> I'm, 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 I'm going to try, like I'm not going to throw the game, but I have nothing that can, man, this is not going to be good. So the first thing we're going to do is retreat to our goal with Mew. He may just bring Mega Gengar right there. I mean, I have nothing to threaten him. Nope. Go cover up the other side here. And I'm just gonna brace myself for the rush. I, I I think this is my best chance because there's so much purple. Hmm. So I attacked into him with my biggest gold attacker. <laughs> and I roll purple and he rolls gold. And that's pretty much going to do it here because there is like I've gotten I've got absolutely nothing. Completely outclassed and outmatched. Gonna have to roll gold into his purple. So the the people who watched a large majority of the stream the live stream today. And this was several hours long. But the thing that they kept saying is I can't believe the rolls you get. I can't, uh, I could X attack. They, they would just constantly comment that it's not just one or two. It's a consistently it, it's just, it's consistently rolling your off roll or them, your opponent just rolling the one roll that they possibly could roll to knock you out. And they, and it was just game after game after game after game was, this is unreal. Like, oh my God, how do you, people, I would throw my phone across the room type stuff. And I get mad too. Like it, it is super annoying. But what are you going to do? You know, I, I, I don't know if everybody has those experiences. That's like, I'm accustomed to it. I've gotten to the point where I kind of expect those things to happen. So there you go. The gym is underway. You've got a week. Pace yourselves. Don't do it all in one day. Kind of ruins the experience, I think. That's going to do it for today's installment. It is Friday. I hope you guys had a great Friday. It's the end of the day Friday, but I hope you guys had a great Friday. 
I might do videos this weekend. I haven't decided yet. So if I do, you guys will be in for a nice little surprise. And if not, we'll see you on Monday. Have a safe weekend. Have a fun weekend. And you can actually do both. I didn't know if you, I, didn't, I wasn't always sure that you could have fun and be safe, but you can do both. And until next time.